friends. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Um, I have a book today about our woodland habitat. So remember, a habitat is a place that um, helps the living things that live there meet their four basic needs. So this habitat provides air, shelter, food, and water for the living things that live there. If those living things were taken out of the habitat and moved to another habitat, they wouldn't be able to survive. So our habitat today is the woodlands, and we're going to read a book called Because of an Acorn. So we're going to see how an acorn can help all of these living things meet their basic needs in the woodlands. Let's get started. Because of an Acorn by Lola M. Schaefer and Adam Schaefer, illustrated by Fran Preston Gannon. Because of an acorn, a tree. Hmm, because of a tree, think about what basic needs the tree can help living things meet. Because of a tree, a bird. Oh, look. See it in the picture there? The bird's meeting one of their basic needs. Because of a bird, a seed. Because of a seed, hmm, a flower. Because of a flower, a fruit. Hmm. Because of a fruit, a chipmunk. Why, friends? Why do you think? Maybe the fruit's helping the chipmunk meet a basic need. Because of a chipmunk, a snake. Because of a snake, a hawk. Hmm. Because of a hawk, an acorn. Because of an acorn, a forest. The end, friends. So we saw a lot of different living things from our woodlands and how they interact together to help meet their basic needs. So the first thing we had in our woodlands was an acorn. And we saw our acorn grow into what, friends? It grew into a tree. And that tree helped another living thing. It helped a bird. Do you remember what the bird um, did in the tree? It built its nest. So it had shelter in the tree so it could live there. And from the seeds grew flowers. And then the flowers helped grow the from the flowers grew fruit, and the fruit meets the basic need of food for lots of different animals, but the animal in our book, it was a chipmunk. And then we talked about prey and predators as well um, at school. So we saw a snake that is a predator for a chipmunk. Um, and then we watched a couple other animals as we went up the food chain. And all together, these living things helped create a forest. Thank you for reading with me today, friends. I really looked forward to reading with you. It makes me so happy. I hope you have a great rest of your day, and I look forward to reading with you again soon. Bye!